Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome to today's SLP update for uh, Sunday 22 of May. And this, this is actually pumping. And I told you guys in some of the previous videos that you have to pay attention to this trend line, right? You really have to pay attention to it because by the end of the day, this was almost a descending triangle. And this triangle I draw for you yesterday has made its decision. And if you look at it this way, uh, I don't know if I want to play the clip from yesterday's video, but I, I already can show you that one. If you've been following the channel, this was a descending triangle that I drew. And I told you, if it tries to break to the upside, then you're looking for this one to go to the 660 or the 6, uh, 663, right? Now, exactly that has already played out. Given that this is your next level of resistance at this point of time so what i'm going to do is i'm going to drop this level of resistance right over there and this is what we're talking about it was all about breaking out i never really actually gave you the idea that i i mean i was speechless man you see if it was to break to the downside then this was your technical target you break out of that place and uh, you drop to the downside so this was your zone down here at the 386 and that was where we're still looking for sop to go to the downside but i'm, I'm still not saying we're so bullish at this point of time but who knows you can still bottom out of this place and try to go to the upside and uh you know make a relief rally make some little bit of green candles since everyone is not expecting sop to actually make its move to the upside but there's one logical place that i do expect as sop maybe to backtest and this is the place where sop never backtested now given that you don't really come down and maybe take out the 47 and 478 now i think the culture has changed for sop right the direction is changing a little bit but i'm not going to say that we're all bullish just yet well, one thing that I'm going to actually put it out there is this tra uh, resistance line, okay? So even if the highest you will go, I believe would be to this resistance point. Let's say you actually do make some moves to the upside, you don't really dump from here, then you might actually just make that relief rally go up and up and up and then touch this resistance, make a bounce from here and continue with the downtrend. Remember this one and put this in your mind because that's the first touch right over there, the second touch right over here. And yes, there's a good chance you still make that relief and go up here, find resistance there and then boom, you go to the downside, okay? So um, favorite retracements are actually going to help determine if there's any more moves to the upside or if you're looking to go way more to the downside so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take the fib levels and let's see where the next resistance basically is going to be so here we are and yes right now you are crossing the golden ratio which is going to be the 0.618 so if you're holding this level if you really hold this level there's a good chance you're actually looking for 826 as your next level and maybe uh, make a little bit of move to the 870s as well and then boom from there maybe make a fake out and then get trapped and then you come down to to continue with the downtrend and potentially drop way more down to the 380s but that one time will tell time will tell i do believe that a huge stop loss should be set down at the 476 even if this is a trade that is going on and uh, that's it for this sop update if you guys want to learn more about trading do check out the trading course and join our discord the link is in the description just click on this link and you're going to be in and there's a long ass video of course 18 hours contents for you to actually learn and uh, do check it out i'm going to see you in the next one Allah office